بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم. Uh, I, I have a question to ask. Yeah. So uh, there is a particular issue happening currently around the Ogumo show. So I wanted to seek uh, your uh, guidance on it. If what should be a Muslim's response to such a an issue? I'm listening. So um, it happens that one of the lecturers uh, stripped off the niqab from one of uh, the sisters. So trying, the sister is uh, currently doing uh, a distant learning nursing. So when the issue happened, a lot of brothers were like, he, 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 uh, he removed the niqab from her face. So actually from the video, it was for, for, for the for, um, from the of the student. So actually, from the videos, it wasn't obvious that it was one that did that. It, it's like someone, someone among his uh, his crew actually got the makeup removed. So the later a got man or a woman, a woman, a woman. The man, uh, the man is a, is a, is the dean of the nursing department. Yes, who removed the makeup? So someone, it's like someone am, amongst the uh, the crew that That's formed. Someone, a woman or man. We can't actually see because the camera did not cover that part of the remote. Was it the woman who was involved, what did she say to you? He said? The woman who was involved, what did she say? What, what did she say? Okay, she, she said that the, the someone, it's someone that got the Nicole removed from her, not the man exactly. Who is the someone? Uh, he, I, don't, I don't actually got that a from male you. Or a female? I think it was a male. I think this was a male. So and uh, the what actually make me call is because there are a lot of there are kind of there was kind of a division between I mean, the brothers in Ogumo show to towards what should our reaction be. Some were of the opinion that we should uh, if we are able to see the man that we should punish him. We sh should do a lot of things like humiliating. Humili Muslim community, the, the community in that school, a Muslim community, are they dead? Uh, the the MSSN they we, they've tried their best to I to ask MSSN. Okay. They are, okay. The Muslim the Muslim community, the elders, the elders. Yes. They, the Muslim community. They are they are elders there, they but have a Muslim community head. They have it. They have. But what is later what apparent? Did they say? They it's like they were also trying to to cover up the the lecturer. Because there are some previous issues that have been, that has been uh, uh, recorded that the man is following. So the Muslim those leaders we are following those the the non-Muslims. Yes. Yeah. Or the Muslims that are oppressing other Muslims. What is uh, obvious is like they were trying to to serve the school uh, to follow the school. Uh, uh, what does the school say? The school was. The school wanted to like. They wanted to like. Uh, they, they wanted to set an investigation panel to see into the matter, and brothers see that certain, doing such will actually later get the matter dragged into the carpet, and they might not want to. It may not drag the matter into the carpet. Hmm. If the school, if the vice chancellor says there should be an investigation, into it, then there should be an investigation. Mm -hmm. into it. Hmm. What the the woman and her husband or her father hmm. who were in charge of her must pay attention to because they are those who are directly involved hmm. those who are directly involved are the woman her husband or hmm. her father, her father. Hmm. and her male children these are uh, her awliya, awliya. Hmm. allah will ask her about herself and allah will ask her I mean, Allah will ask her, Aulia, her husband, her father, about her. Mm. If she's a woman that's alone, her male son comes, her uncle comes. Mm. Do you understand? I understand, sir. So these are the people who have the duty to protect a woman directly. Directly. Mm. Before you begin to talk about the rest of the Muslims in the community, mm. with our fellow students. Or other elders in the Muslim community. Directly, the woman has a duty to protect herself mm. and her religion. Mm. And then the, the uh, 
أولياء أفادة عرضا أرسميل جالس أز كيسني بي They have the duty to protect her. So these are the people that must prefer um, writings, papers, so, and uh, attendance mm-hmm. to face the panel. So like what, like we, the other Muslims now, so what should now be our reaction to us? Yes, to protect the rest, to protect one of you who was treated badly. And so is it a, yes, a panel? You, you, the Muslim students too. I think that there, 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 there has been community. some set of lawyers that have taken up the the yes. matter actually on behalf of on, who? on behalf of the I think on behalf of the the the, 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 the woman and the husband. Yes, yes. So and some of some of the brothers are actually uh, supporting with the financial aspect okay. of it. So, but what actually, well, some of the things that actually prompt me to call is that so there are some that were like, he should go other way around that if they're able to get the hold of the man that they should humiliate him, humiliate him and that they should, even if it's possible, they can they get can't access take to him. They can't take clothing to their own. If you leave this world to be like that, there will be commotion everywhere. everywhere. Hmm. Islam does not encourage us to take clothes. You want to punish the man. You can't. You are not in that. The society, community does not place you in that condition. Islam does not put you. You are not a policeman. Even if you're a policeman, you can only effect an arrest. You still have to bring the man to the court of law. You understand? I understand, sir. Muslims shouldn't take laws to our hands. No matter the case. Now, in fact, the point goes up to yeah. the days of Jahiliya. Yeah. The days of Jahiliya when the messenger was not there. Mm. Ali, so Ali, so there were no leader. Mm. To everybody, there was just jungle justice. Mm. We Muslims should not do that. Mm. Yeah. If I look on, uh, let's say in an instant whereby this happened in one's presence, is it allowed for someone to overreact like attempting to to assist if the sister, the woman cannot uh, at all uh, be able to defend herself. If a Muslim, if the Muslims were in that kind of a place, mm. when the man started to harass the woman, mm. they will go there. Mm. They can stop the man from harassing her. Mm. Do you understand? If understand. he is not physical, he mm. will not be physical too. But if he physically harasses her, they have a duty to physically yeah, prevent it. Prevent it. So the, to be on based on the situation, the matter. Yes, yes, yes. Mm-hmm. If he did not physically harass the woman, then they should not touch him physically. Or if he physically touches the woman, they should physically prevent him. Mm-hmm. Right. So now, now, but last. Not the woman herself. Herself. Mm-hmm. So now, is it also now encouraged to always advise our wives and our girls, female children, to try to always defend themselves whenever such wants to happen? Or what do you mean by defend themselves? Like, like, man, he, she's like, like if laughing. someone if someone called them in such an instance that they shouldn't answer because he he, he actually called them in an open floor, trying oh, to. Have no right to call her. He has no right to call her. Is he her teacher? Is the dean of this thing, dean of faculty? If he is the dean, she's a student in that faculty. Okay. She should go. She does not have a right to reject. To reject. Now it depends when she goes to him in the open place. So like when the when the like what happened in the videos, he was trying to use them like the the, the description just like trying to emulate their dressing and their she outlook. Can walk away. She can walk away. She can walk away from us. Yeah. So but in an instance whereby he, because she he, has a right not to be humiliated. To be humiliated. No. So in an instance whereby someone trying to drag or tr- can she also protect herself? Yes. But if the males, Muslim males are there, they, uh, they, they will have to be to protect her. Yeah. Is that cool? Okay. Asana Allah. Sir, can I can I benefit if I wait it or can she just? Yes, no problem, being there. No. Is that cool? Okay. I mean, I got aware. Is that the man that they were causing? 
You say so? Was that the man that people were causing and begging for? Exactly. I was also I was also want to ask about that. So that is it? Can we also cause him as a Muslim? Because we already know yes. he's a Muslim brother, like us. Yes, he can be caused. He can be caused. Whether he is a Muslim or not, or not. Mm. he can be caused directly. Directly. Mm. Mm. The Prophet Muhammad encouraged that. Alayhi salatu wa sallam. There is a hadith in Al Adab al Mufrad mm. We are under the rights of neighbors. Mm. A man used to cause harm to his neighbor. Mm. You understand? I understand, sir. So the man went to the neighbor, went to report to the Prophet. Alayhi salatu wa Repeatedly he was doing it. The man mm-hmm. went to the messenger alayhi salatu salam and complained about the neighbor. Mm-hmm. Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam told that man who complained to bring his property to the public. Mm-hmm. Wow. So when he brought his property to the public, when people passed by, they asked him, why are you bringing all your mattress, mm-hmm. all your things to the public? But because the, my neighbor is causing me inconvenience. Mm-hmm. Do you understand? And people and started coughing that neighbor that neighbor was bringing mm-hmm. 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 Do you understand? I understand, I understand. When they cost him, he heard of it. He was saying, Allahumma al-anhu, Allahumma al-anhu, mm-hmm. Allah cursing, oh Allah cursing. Mm-hmm. When that person heard, he quickly went to invite that person back to the house. To the house. Mm-hmm. Allah and was assuring him that he never cursed him again. Okay. Mm-hmm. He came to the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam to the report by Ali Imam Abu Dawood and the Prophet said to him sallallahu alayhi wa sallam Kana la'an Allahi ala la'ani Allahu Akbar La'an au kama qala alayhi sallam The la'an of Allah is upon the la'an of the people Allahu Akbar So it's lawful when a person commits a sin like this that is public Hmm. It's harmful to the people. It can be caused. Allah. Okay. Don't forget that uh, he said, "Itaku Allahi name." Avoid the things that make people curse you. Curse you. Maybe. One of them is a person who goes to defecate under the tree where people rest in the afternoon. Okay. Hmm. When people come there, what do they say in the afternoon? They want to rest. They just find that somebody else has defecated. Defecated on their way. Hmm. What will they say? They will start causing it. Or in the morning, they have, they have a water path. Mm. A path that leads to water. No it's one goes and defecates there. Yeah. The first person to come places his feet on that defecation. What will he say? He will definitely cause it. The person say, avoid that. Mm. So now only two have been mentioned by the ulama. Say every behavior that when people hear and see it, they will cause the person who did it. Nobody should do that. Mm. Do you understand? Yeah, I understand, sir. Also, when we talked about um, handling handling uh, our slaves or service people who work for us, mm. someone punished an animal in Islam, punished a camel mm. so much that smoke was coming out from the nose of the camel. Allah, Allah. The Prophet wasallam said, لَعَنَ اللَّهُ مَنْ فَعَلَ هَذَا Allah has caused this animal so much harm that smoke was coming out from the nose of the camel. So there are some things when you do it, you can be caused. And that cause will reach the person. The like of it is what Allah mentioned in the Quran about scholars who hide knowledge. What did he say? Ulaika so the man has to publicly apologize he has to publicly show tawba. Do you understand? And change understand his ways. At that time, Allah will forgive him. Mm. Because Allah is at tawabu and ar rahim. Mm. So it is lawful to cause him. Mm. 
Mosha. And any such person who does such a thing, okay. it is lawful to cuff him. And so, then when they are cuffed, the rest of the people will not like to do something like that. Like that to you. Because the cuffs shall reach them. Hmm. So the cause is from the dawah of Vulm. Hmm. The dawah of Vulm that he committed is the cause is directed to him from the Muslim. Hmm. So the woman is Muslim, her awliya are, are, are Muslim, hmm. the rest of the Muslims are Muslim. Hmm. Wow, wow. So they have a right to cause him. Wow, wow. Things like that should be caused. And immediately they will quickly find the effect of the cost because they start saying who Rabbein Allah is hijab. Rabbein Allah, Rabbein Allah, Rabbein Allah is hijab. They start saying ha, Rabbein Allah is hijab. Wow. May Allah protect us. He wow. has a right to be. They have the people have a right to cost. I think I have mentioned a hadith and verse of Quran. I think it's okay. It's okay. No, it's not about me. Now you are coming back here. الحمد لله رب العالمين